Let's get down on all fours onto the floor and let's get started. Shoulders are in line with your wrists and you're pressing your palms down into the floor, lifting your shoulder blades away and you're going to extend your left leg back behind you and you're going to lift. Press, squeeze those glutes. Lifting the navel in. Nice, strong line here. Long, straight knee. Your ankle is extended and long. Sharp, sharp, lift it, hold. And up, and hold. And up, good, just like that. Good, lift, pull, lift, pull. Now you're gonna bring the knee, bend it in all the way through. So you're really making room for that leg now. If you need to come up onto your fingertips, flex the foot in front of you, lower the chest and lift. For a nice stretch in the hamstring. Breathe. Hold it down here for a little bit. And press up. And again, you can flex, lower and hold. Press up. Now, flex the back leg, the toes tucked under to lift your knee straight behind you. Bring the front leg back and extend your right leg behind you. Lift and lower. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Here. 
Standing leg is nice and straight. Hips over your knees. Knees in line with your ankles. Sharp when you come up and hold. Lower with control. Don't let it fall and flop down. Lower it with purpose, with resistance. Good. Now a little test of balance here. Go up on your releve. So your heels come off the floor and just try and hold. Take one hand off the chair or the wall. Hold. And good. Release. Just always something to think about. Toes turned out. A nice wide squat here. Lower the hips. Lift. Lower. Good. Extend the legs. And when I'm extending, I'm squeezing everything in. Squeeze. In. Elongate. Open those hips. Good. Really squeeze in. Now stay down, lift the heel off the floor, and you're gonna lift those hips up and down. You can add the arms. Good. Nice. Now try and lift the other ankle heels off the floor and press the legs straight. Good. Slowly release the heels down. Turn to your other side. Come on down to all fours. Now you're going to extend your right leg back, lift, and lower. Squeeze. Hook. Hook. Controlled and with purpose. Keep lifting, keep breathing. Hup, 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 hup. Work from the back of the leg here. Good. Bend the knee, bring it in front of you through. Make room for your leg to come through. You can come up onto your fingertips here and lower the chest. Stretch the back of the hamstring here. You can flex or keep the leg pointed. The nice long ankle, extended ankle. Good, now hold it down here, hold. Press into your thigh. 
Keeping that knee nice and long and straight. Lift away. Give yourself a little break. Breathe and go back down. Lift up away. One more time. Nice long chest. Relax the neck. Lower. Breathe. Come up. Curl the toes, back toes underneath. Bring that leg back. And then your left leg extends back behind you. To lower and lift. In this three-legged dog position. Pressing away from the floor, shoulders away. Good. Now from here, I'm going to bend and lift. Bend and lift. Turn those toes out 
and then lower the hips and lift. A little bounce here and lift. Bounce and lift. Long spine. Good. And now, moment of truth. Lift the other heel up. Extend those legs straight all the way. Heels are lifted off the floor. And when you're ready, control those heels down. Turn the toes face forward. Chest comes forward. Ah. Give those hamstrings a little stretch. Think of pressing those shoulder blades together. Pressing your elbows together. A nice long neck, long spine. Hands down, come down onto the floor. And now you might need a cushion or a pillow uh, underneath your hips here to give yourself a little height. Uh, I will demonstrate it on the floor because I have uh, quite mobile hip flexors. So from here, with the cushion or the pillow underneath your hips, giving your legs that added height off of the floor to start with. I want you to open the knees, squeeze them together. Open, squeeze. Keep a nice long spine. Don't have to stay arched up here. We're targeting those glutes, upper back of your legs. Squeeze, squeeze. Open, getting a little stretch in those hips, opening those hips. Toes together. Good. Extend those knees totally straight. I'm going to come forward here. Yes. And here I just want you to lower and lift. Ankles are squeezed together, toes are extended. Squeeze, squeeze as you lift, squeeze. Huh. You can do it, you got this. Go, up, 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 squeeze. Squeeze until you shake. <laughs> Come on, let's do 10 more. Hold, hold, and lower down. Beautiful. Bring your hands down, next to your chest. Just extend. Lift your chest away from the floor and breathe. Nice. Now I just want you to stretch those glutes. So you're gonna come here. Nice. 
and put a little bit of weight. You can either just press gently, not the whole time, but press the knee down and let it come up. Take a breather, press down. And then if you're feeling really adventurous or needing that extra stretch, lower your body on top of your calf here. You can do it with movement, which I always love doing and suggest. Not just sitting in it and holding it there and suffering the whole time. You'll get there through patience and consistent work. That's why if you press away, you're giving your body a little break and then you come back into it just gently, intuitively, what feels good to you. And switch onto the other leg. Right leg forward, bend the knee. Just feel where, wherever you're feeling that stretch, right in this position before you go any further. And then when you are ready, take that next step. You can push the knee down. Even if it is already down, just that added little pressure. I feel an extra stretch in a different area. So try it, play around with it and see what feels good, what your body needs. That's what this is really all about, what you need and about discovering it and researching it and finding it. I'm here just to, you know, guide you, show you examples of what, what you might need and then you'll figure it out from, uh, from here. Lower the chest, lift, lower. Lower, you can come down, put your forehead onto your back of your hands and just sort of breathe, meditate, let go of whatever's holding you down, whatever's keeping you down. Breathe and let it go. Tomorrow is a new day. And that's the beauty about life. We get a new chance every day. And albeit it's been really hard this year but I do have some hope that next year will present new avenues for strength and hope in everyone's life. I'm thinking of everybody and I hope you guys are all doing well. I hope you enjoy these free sessions that um, I love sharing with you and I wish everyone a happy new year and a healthy new year. Bye.